A clash between two groups in Uttar Pradesh, Kasganj area took an early, uh, ugly turn today as shops were set on fire and buses were vandalized. Now the footage that we are showing you on your screens is not live. This is from earlier today. Now though the situation continues to be tense right now with sporadic incident vandalism still being reported. The violence reportedly erupted during a bike rally taken out by a group of local youth on Friday. Authorities have shut down schools and colleges as a precautionary measure and companies of the RAF and the PAC along with police forces have been deployed to maintain law and order. An FIR has also been lodged in the Kotwali police station against 26 men under various sections of the IPC. Police have assured stringent action against those engaged in violence and damage of private property. 49 arrests have been made so far. Kasgar city in Kasgar city, well, that was Subhash Chandra Sharma, the additional, uh, the, the commissioner, I'm sorry, of the Aligarh range who was speaking on the violence in Kasgan. Joining me now is Amir Haq, our correspondent. Amir, uh, tell us uh, what is the situation uh, right now in uh, Kasgan? Well, the situation is uh, tensed, but uh, it's under control. We we have the latest update from Kasganj uh, from uh, from around uh, 5 p.m. this evening itself, when uh, the administrative officials have said that uh, the situation is perfectly under control now. They've uh, arrested about uh, four dozen people uh, for uh, incidents of arson and uh, clashes, and uh, you know companies of PAC and RAF uh, have been called in. Uh, uh, in fact, uh, uh, police force has also been called in from uh, the neighboring districts, and now it seems that uh, 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 that the administration has a grip over uh, things there in Kasganj. But uh, over the last two days, over the last 48 hours, uh, the situation actually spiraled out of control. When on early morning on the 26th of January, Friday, uh, 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 several youth on motorbikes were taking out uh, uh, Tiranga rally when uh, there were clashes, intermittent clashes between. Uh, various groups. Uh, now it is still not clear what uh, exactly prompted uh, the violence between these two groups. Now this is a subject of investigation which the administration will carry out. Uh, but uh, immediately after the clashes uh, in one of the shooting incidents, uh, uh, there was one person who actually sustained grievous injuries and later uh, succumbed to his injuries in a government hospital and that uh, further uh, uh, kind of uh, spiraled uh, the the incidents of violence there in Kasganj and uh, the police found it uh, absolutely difficult to control and the reinforcements actually took time to came, come in. So something uh, that uh, really, you know, raises questions on uh, uh, on the law and order there and, uh, uh, and uh, the proficiency of police uh, in containing and controlling this violence. Uh, immediately after that, uh, there were incidents of uh, arson wherein several vehicles were set on fire, uh, several shops and houses... Uh, right were also, uh, uh, you know, uh, right, put on Amir. fire. Right, but what you're telling us right now is though the situation is tense, it is coming under control as we speak. The situation is under control.